Welcome back to Cleveland. We're with the interim head coach Dave Bell ahead of this uh, second matchup with the Monsters. Uh, you said last night that uh, you get what you work for, and after uh, looking at the tape, uh, does that feeling still stand? 100%, 100%, and I think uh, showed the guys today. We did, we did have spurts and shifts where we worked, and, and we had some ozone time and uh, turned some pucks over. But for the most part, uh, our first uh, read of the game was correct after watching the tape. Uh, so again, I, I guess I kind of asked last night: Is uh, that effort level the one thing that you think will really make a difference tonight? 100%. Um, effort covers up a lot of warts and a lot of mistakes. And uh, when you make mistakes and you don't work, it's going to be in the back of your net and teams are going to put up big numbers like they did last night. So obviously uh, the work ethic has to be there and I, and I think it will be today. Uh, we talked a little bit about special teams last night. Um, when you're on kind of a drought like this, uh, especially on the power play, is it a matter of guys just maybe gripping the stick a little too tight and overthinking? Is, is that uh, a way to perhaps simplify things? I think uh, simplifying it is the best word. We did simplify it today. Uh, obviously, everything starts with uh, you have to shoot the puck to score, and I thought we passed up a couple good looks. We got some elite shooters that, that are on our power play, and we didn't get enough shots. So look to get a little more shot volume tonight with uh, with a good, solid net front presence and, and see if we can get some ugly ones. And uh, did score with some good net front presence as well in the Aspro goal yesterday, so that's obviously something that will work uh, moving forward. Uh, a real early start here uh, this afternoon, and uh, this season at least this team has not been great and afternoon starts. Um, how do you kind of change that uh, theme and, and what are the keys to being prepared to go uh, six hours earlier than you're used to? Well, they're pros. They have to get ready, but uh, we did uh, implement a mandatory uh, workout over and above what they normally do themselves. So just to get the, the brain going and the muscles firing today, I think uh, there shouldn't be an excuse. We're going to eliminate that with uh, a monitored uh, pregame activation. And uh, obviously Mitch Freeburn helping to get the guys through their paces here early on and get them uh, ready to go. Uh, any changes on the lineup front this afternoon? Yeah, we uh, two guys in, two guys out, and a new goalie. Uh, can you tell us who those uh, guys are? Sure, we got Lucas Savage in, Rubens is in, and uh, Bebo is going to be in the net. And Antoine Bebo hasn't started uh, since New Year's Eve. Uh, any worry about uh, Russ to shake off, or uh, how do you get him uh, in the mix, I guess, early on? No, no worries. He's a good teammate. He works hard. Uh, the players love him, play for him, and uh, he's a battler. So he, he, he has some rust to shake off, but again, it's the same as a player. Uh, work ethic will cover up some of those, uh, the rust. Yeah, and I guess lastly, aside from that work ethic, what are the other keys to picking up a, a split here in Cleveland this afternoon? Well, you touched on it at the start, obviously, and then uh, the shift length. With the quick turnaround, uh, can't get extended in our shifts, and uh, to keep the energy level high is that. So it's, it's the shift length and, and the start. Thanks, Coach. Good luck this afternoon. Thank you.